If you're a food professional, be patient when it comes to the questions. It may be the most obvious thing to you, but to someone with a fledgling love and fledgling knowledge of food, you don't want to rebuff them so early because their curiosity is really what will propel them forward in a very difficult career at times. If you have a chance to bring someone under your wing, uh, let them stage in your kitchen, um, have a class at your restaurant. If you see a young culinary competitor doing something wrong, gently correct them. Make your knowledge available. Write something in your local community paper. Put your recipes out online. I think with the amount of culinary talent in that room, and we have some heavy hitters, that any given one of these students would grow under their tutelage. So I think that it's got to be remember when you were back there and treat them the way you wish you had been treated. I encourage all the young people to ask those questions, to constantly uh, write stuff down, you know, explore outside of your comfort zone. But I also think keeping your eyes on the prize, that it's about that journey. And I love it. If you talk to the Bobby Flays and the Alex Guarnaschellis of the world, they'll tell you they're still learning. They're still experimenting. And never lose that childlike curiosity. You know, I, I think it's the best.